Hi guys, it's me again. Welcome to my channel, Kath in Japan. And for today's video, I want to share with you my nature blog. It's about tulips. And today we will go to the tulip farm and see the beauty of the tulips. And also today I decided to have an English only challenge because uh, of my previous videos, I use uh, English language and Tagalog language and oh, I will challenge myself to speak only English. Okay, let's join me. Julie Farm is only a walking distance from our place and as I'm walking through the tulip farm, you can see beautiful views of the nature. Guys, here is the view of nature. You can see the river and you can see the trees there. Guys, we're here already. You know, I'm awkward in speaking uh, English on the spot because I'm not used to it. For 10 years of staying here in Japan, I always use Japanese language. That's why I'm not used to it. Okay, we're near at the tulip farm. See? Okay, but I must take a walk to go there. Maybe it will take minutes. There, you can see. You can see the yellowish and reddish colors. I want, I want to show you also these flowers. Maybe it looks like uh, umi, umi or plum, plum flowers here. You see the scenery in our place. It's a lot of fields, many fields, many greenery scenes. Guys, maybe a few steps will be reaching the tulip farms and I'm so excited. This board means that the first grade students of Ochino Elementary School planted these tulips with heart. Tulip form a genus of a spring blooming perennial herbaceous bulbiferous geopites. The flowers are usually large, showy, and brightly colored, generally red, pink, yellow, or white. They often have a different colored blotch at the base of the tepals internally. These tulips were planted during November, and by early or mid-April, the tulip would start to bloom. The flowering season of tulips continued till the mid of May. During the flowering season, the leaves of the tulips develop. The foliage or green leaves plays an important role in the life cycle of tulips. Tulips height ranges from 6 inches to 2 feet. One tulip grows on each stem with 2 to 6 broad leaves per plant. Many tulips smell grassy green. Hexinol and hexinyl acetate are responsible for this particular green and rather apple-like aroma. A considerable part of tulip flowers has a spicy aromatic smell produced by oxymeni, eucalyptol, phenene, and lemonene dominance. There are many types of tulip, but the tulip you can see in our place is called garden tulip or tulipa gesneriana, the didier's tulip or garden tulip is a species of plants in the lily family cultivated as an ornamental in many countries because of its large showy flowers this tall late blooming species has a single blooming flower and linear or lanceolate leaves the didier tulip or garden tulip probably originates in western or central asia it is one of the root species that gave rise to the thousands of tulip cultivars. Now let's see closely every colors of the tulip with me. This is color white.
the innocent color of pink the bright color of yellow the seductive color of red the sophisticated color of violet the combination of yellow and red color it's so sunny and hot weather today that's why my face turned like this let's have a last look around the tulip farm I just uh, finished uh, taking videos of uh, tulip sorry I can't uh, speak uh, English there while taking videos because there are so many people yeah that's why uh, people I see this uh, sakura leaves falling down I'm on my way home already and I have seen all the beautiful tulip flowers and it was amazing and today I practice my English only speaking challenge that's why today I'm, I feel fulfilled so if you like this video please subscribe like comment or share thank you guys See you on my next vlog. God bless.